guys welcome back i am so glad you're here i miss you guys i always miss you guys during the week i just get so like down and like work hard that at the end of the week i always love and enjoy sitting down and hanging out with you guys and so for today's video we're gonna be doing the awesome boxy charm lux unboxing for the month of June. If you are not aware, this is like a beauty subscription, beauty makeup subscription, and the original BoxyCharm retails for $21 a month, and then you can also always upgrade to a Lux, and now they have different other like variations of this box as well, but you pay an additional, I believe, $25 every three months, or $27. I'm gonna have to like double check on that, but it is such a great beauty box. It has, it's definitely my favorite box of all time as like a subscription box. And you get like the best, well-known, really awesome brands that are sold at Sephora and Ulta. And so I always get so thrilled to get in these boxes, especially these Lux ones. I think they have like a retail value of over $300, which is like crazy because you pay only like, I don't know, 30 bucks if that. And so let's go ahead and jump into it. Let's go. So I'm going to open the box. There is a little bit of like paper. Then we have our little pamphlet with all the products in the back with the pricing. Then we have two different things. One is a little pamphlet. It's a coupon. Enjoy $5 off from Kylie Skin by Kylie Jenner. Okay, and then this other one is from Pure Elise. And it's about a BB cream, which is right in here. So let's read about it a little bit. So it says, Beauty Through Asian Wisdom, a multitasking beauty balm that is a foundation, antioxidants, moisturizer, and an SPF 30 in 1. Very nice. So the benefits improve skin complexion, softens and even skin tone, hydrates the skin, helps reduce fine lines and wrinkles, dark spots, dullness, and other signs of aging, and prevents UVA and UVB damage. Crazy! That's a lot for a little BB cream. Okay, let's go ahead and swatch on the arm. So BB, so there's two different kind of like creams for the face. There's a CC cream and a BB cream. CC stands for like color correcting. So it's very like lightweight and very, very minimal coverage. And then we have BB creams, which are a little bit, I don't know, what does it stand for? Um, blemish based or blemish something. Um, and these compared to the CC creams are usually a little bit more higher in coverage. So like they're a little bit more opaque like more pigmented so this is in the shade light let's go ahead and squeeze on the hand just to see kind of like how um how much coverage i would get so it is in a color all right all right okay so that definitely really quickly evened out my skin tone on my hand Ooh, that's really nice so if you guys know my preferences, I usually um, just go for like a moisturizer and I'm super into like super full coverage, but this seems like it has a really decent amount of coverage. Like look at that difference, huh? Perfect glow BB cream and it has like a really refreshing like glow to it. Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to try this out. But so far, I'm really impressed. Okay, let's keep moving. So the next is a little duo by Eco. And this is a self-care pure essential oil base. Ooh, essential oils. I love them. I use them sometimes in my bath. You can use these for anything. So we have two of them. So one is a woman's blend aroma. And the other one is a calm de-stress aroma. So let's go ahead and give them a little whiff. Ooh. A lot of like citrus, orange peel. What else am I smelling? Oh my gosh, I don't know, but it's very like refreshing and citrusy. And this other one, and this other one is women's blend. And this smells like, oof, I don't know if I like that. So I'm not sure I'm a big fan of the second one, but let me read you guys some ingredients in these. So the calm and distressful blend, the first one, it has, it seems like it has a lot of citrus, it has sandalwood, wood oil, it has um, pog, pogasamont, 
leaf. I don't know if I'm even pronouncing that even remotely closely. So for the women's blend, it says, okay, I'm gonna so mispronounce these names, Cedrus Atlantica Bark. So that's like Satyrwood oil, Lavendula, which I think is like lavender flower leaf extracts, Pelargonium Gravilorus leaf. I don't know what that is. I have no idea. It has Kananga Odorata flower. Okay, I'm gonna quit right there because I'm not gonna butcher any more names for now. And so those are some things, but it's it's like, it's very spicy, if that makes any sense. And it's kind of musky, but it's spicy, not in like the best way. It almost smells like almost like a seasoning. Um, blend, which is not my favorite, but this like calm and de-stressful one I am definitely gonna use because I don't know if you guys follow me on TikTok, but on Thursday this week, I was just like, I was dealing with a lot of like negative energy and toxicity and like really like ugh, frustrating individuals. And so I just got so like anxious and like nervous and like very, very weird mood Thursday was for me. And so... And if you guys follow me on TikTok, I decided to kind of take control over the situation and over my mood. And I decided to kind of do things that make me zen, peaceful, positive. And so I went shopping. I got my lashes filled. Um, I c came up with a couple projects and I repainted a wall in my mom's house. And what else? And there was like a couple other things that I did too. I organized all my shoes, which I will insert pictures here if you guys want to see. And so those are some things that really like calm me down. And so essential oils like this, you just put like a little drop here or like under your like um, ears right here or on your temples and it really helps to like just like keep you calm and just it helps to de-stress most definitely so enough about that let's go ahead and continue next is a pure heels by nature village propolis 80 sleeping mask Woohoo! i love sleeping masks i i feel like that's when my skin gets the most moisture because i don't moisturize like crazy so this is what it looks like and it looks like it has a lot of like honey or bee ingredients on the package oh it smells really refreshing this is what it looks like it's kind of like a jelly consistency nice and it smells really refreshing, so I am definitely going to be putting this one to use. If you guys have used this before, because I've never heard of this brand before. If you guys have used this before, let me know what you guys think. If you guys have used any of these products, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Next is a Kylie Skin by Kylie Jenner Foaming Face Wash. Okay, I did not even realize she had like a face wash um product so this is nice i thought she just like kind of owned makeup but this is what it looks like super cute super fancy you know it has this like frosted bottle which is plastic not glass and then it has a really cute little pink top and it is in like a foaming squeezy tube i almost want to like hold on let's so we can smell it or not Ooh. okay Okay, I don't know if it's the plastic cardboard I'm smelling, but I'm not smelling anything. Yeah, I'm not really. It's it's kind of like very little fragranced, which I was really curious to see like what it smelled like. I don't know why. I'm just weird like that. But um, we're going to have to like put it to the test. Next is a Tula Skincare. Oh, my mom loves this brand of skincare. This is the Tula Skincare. Skincare. This is the Glow and Get It Cooling and Brightening Eye Balm. Okay, so I'm not even going to open this. I'm going to give it straight to my mom. She loves this brand. She loves, like, um, she uses, like, this really thick moisturizer that they have with, like, probiotics and some other, like, I think, like, a scrub mask that she uses or a scrub cleanser. I'm not even sure what it is, but my mom loves this brand, and so I'm going to go ahead and give it to her. Next, we have a little spray bottle with M Green Grass. CBD head to toe cream. All right, country of origin, the USA. So we have a CBD. Okay, kind of like a moisturizer, I'm assuming maybe. Um, it says head to toe, so I guess you could technically use it on anything and everything. <laughs> Is that so? All right. Um, maybe it smells like a teeny tiny bit herbally. 
but nothing too crazy nothing too like much scented very moisturizing very um like soft i mean i don't I, I don't know what else i mean it's nice it's a little bit tacky maybe it could be like nice as like a moisturizer under foundation i don't know i'm gonna have to play around with it next moving on we have two more items and i see let's jump into this one this is the tarte tardis pro palette you guys i love this palette i had this palette i owned it and oh and i gave it away and so like it made its way back to me that's so cute i'm gonna open it and show you guys i don't know if i'm gonna swatch it because i might give it away since i gave away like my original one because i you guys know i do like giveaways for you guys or i give them to friends or donate like makeup that i don't use or that i'm not like super like in love with or that i get tired of just to share oh my goodness look what i just did do you see this oh my goodness okay well there's that and so this is what this palette looks like and i absolutely love the formula this is all matte these are shimmers and they are such good quality like this palette in specific these mattes are so creamy so good so like oh, pigmented and like really easy to blend out i love this palette and oh maybe just because it made its way back to me it's a sign that i should use it again I don't know. I'll think about it, but I do really like Tarte Shadows for sure. And then last but not least, we have a duo liner set. And this is by Body Bodyography Professional Cosmetics. This is a set of two line pencils or lip pencils. Okie dokie. So these are the two colors. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of swatching. So we have a more of like a raspberry color. Very nice. And then we also have a like a nude color. Ooh, that seems so pretty. I feel like this is so nice. All right. And so those are the things in today's BoxyCharm unboxing. And let's go over the pricing really quickly. So the Kylie Skin by Kylie Jenner is $24.00. The Pure Lease Beauty Perfection BB Cream is $35. Then we have the Tula Skincare Eye Cream, which is $28. We have the Tarte Tardis Pro Glow or Pro Amazonian Clay Palette. This one right here, it retails for $49. Then we jump to the Eco Essential Oils Duo, and this retails for $40. Then we have the little CBD um, I had to toe cream, which I think I might give to my brother because he's all into that. So um, this retails for $56. Then we have the Pure Heels Propolis 80 Sleeping Mask. And this retails for $55. Ooh, that's a hefty price tag on it. Just like a face sleeping mask. Okay. Okay. And then last but not least, we have the two pencil lip pencil set duo and these retail for $28. So with the power of magic, this is the total for this month's box. And so what do we think? All right. So $315, I believe the total value, I think personally, it's still way worth it. Cause even if I don't use half of these things, I still get a bigger value than what I actually paid for. So I'm always like pro boxy charm 100%. And some boxes or like some months are better than others, obviously, because everyone has different like personal preference. But so far, I mean, I love the palette. I already know I love it because I've had it in the past. I'm excited about this sleeping mask. The essential oils, I'm going to use one of them. The other one, I'm probably going to give away. Um, this Kylie um, cleanser, I mean, I don't know. This is going to be a great little tiny, like, random mini gift for my mom. Oh, and I'm probably most excited about the BB cream because it gave me such great, like, coverage. And, like, it evened out my skin tone. For a BB cream, like, this is great coverage. So I'm really excited to test this out, especially now in the summer. I tried to do a little bit less makeup. Um, and so I usually just do like concealer. I mean, today I have a little bit more and I have my like super foxy eye again, which woohoo, I love it. But I feel like this was a great box. 
what did you guys get what did you guys think oh there was one thing that i really wanted to get in this box because i saw kathleen lights unbox her box um and it was like the first aid beauty um scrub but it's okay i went on to sephora i purchased it oh oh my gosh by the way did you guys know that sephora now if you guys have points accumulated with her with her with sephora they are doing like 500 points equals ten dollars off of your purchase so i bought the first aid scrub the mini version which was like 10 bucks for free i got it for free i added it in the basket and then i put the little code in to convert the 500 points to ten dollars and literally it costed me zero to get the first beauty scrub so i'm gonna be getting that and so i'm really excited because i have a ton of points with sephora and i'm like their prizes and their little reward system usually always sucked okay no offense to sephora but seriously i was like when are they gonna start converting points into money like ulta has been doing forever and so they are doing it now i don't know if it's like a permanent thing or if it's a like a just limited thing that they're doing and testing it out but i love it because you can get like things that are on sale even more on sale if you have points with them so anyways i think that's it i think that's it i'm gonna stop rambling on um, I'm going to be doing a couple collab videos next week, so definitely stay tuned. I'm super excited with a couple YouTubers here that I just absolutely adore. And there was other things I really wanted to catch you guys up on, which, oh my gosh, this video is going to be so long. But if you're still here, um, I just wanted to let you guys know that I've been doing a lot of research about the EWG, the Environmental Working Group. Um, verified label which is like a quickly to summarize which is like a verification of ingredients that are really of products that list first of all list all their ingredients in the ingredients section and second of all that their ingredients are not harmful to the body because other countries have banned so many different ingredients um, that people and you know companies cannot put into products but America has very few banned products and so the EWG ensures that all the ingredients in the products that we use every day are listed, number one, and two, that are healthy for us and non-toxic, non-harmful, which I've been doing a lot of research. I'm really kind of like super into it. Also, I've been watching a lot of Philip DeFranco because I adore him and he has a great channel here. If you haven't like watched his stuff, he like brings you the news straight on like without any bs i absolutely love it and he has this podcast with a little interview or like a little podcast kind of questionnaire with his wife which is so cute i will try to link it down below what else um really quickly i think that's it i feel like there was a lot of things i wanted to update you guys on but i feel like for now those are all the things if you guys want me to talk about any of those or like expand on the ewg or anything else like that let me know in the comments down below and so i'm gonna wrap up this video because it is hot i am hot oh arizona is so crazy it was like 115 the other day and i was like Ugh, dying but anyways that'd be it for today's video i am sending you guys lots of love for me to you stay happy stay positive and i will see you guys super soon lots of love bye Mwah.